Did you notice the difference in the audio between those two clips? Here they are again. The reason these clips sound different is explained by the Doppler effect, and that's what we're talking about in this video. Let's start with a sound source emitting sound in all directions. Notice that the wavelength is uniform in every direction. The wavelength is correlated with frequency, longer wavelength, lower frequency. And frequency correlates with the perceived pitch of a sound, lower frequency, lower pitch. So no matter where you stand in relation to this sound source, the frequency and pitch will remain the same. However, when the sound source starts to move, the wave fronts are bunched together in the front and spread apart behind. The waves are produced at the same frequency, but the center of each new wavefront is displaced by the motion of the sound source. A listener in front of the source will hear a higher frequency, and a listener behind the source will hear a lower frequency. Let's demonstrate this. I'll fasten a sound source to this rope and swing it around overhead. Listen for the pitch. It should increase as the sound source comes toward you and decrease as the sound source moves away. The same principle, the Doppler effect, explains the clips at the beginning of the video. As the car approached the stationary listener, the sound waves from the engine shortened, which increased the pitch to that listener. Then the engine sound seemed lower in pitch as the car passed by and the wavelengths lengthened. But the car engine sounded the same to the driver throughout the clip. That's because the car wasn't moving in relation to that driver. Relative motion is what matters most when it comes to the Doppler effect. That's why the engine sounded normal to the driver who was moving with the car. All of these sounds were created using Doppler plugins, which allow you to apply the Doppler effect to any sound. I just logged into Epidemic Sound and downloaded a few car engine clips, and those sounded like this at the beginning. The Waves Doppler plugin is great for quick setup, but the Sound Particles plugin offers more real-world settings for dialing in the sound. I'll leave a link to both of those plugins in the description below, and I'll also leave a link to Epidemic Sound with a huge library of sound effects.